Now, we don't have a lot of magic left, and the place we need to get to is fairly far away, and the stuff in this area is deadly. Very deadly, so uh, let's see if we can make it or not. Oh boy. Okay. I'm going to try to run unless I run into parties of enemies that only have like one enemy in it. Please run. Okay. We fought the Batboons before. The Cyclopses hit really, really hard. And there's actually an upgraded version of them running around this area too. I think we need to go over here. Keep running. Come on. Void fights. He made it. Okay. Oh, the enemies in this area are very bad. Hello. I'm a hero. I made it through the Cave of Rome. This travel door takes one back to the underworld. If that is thy wish, please enter. I'm guessing by the underworld you mean the Cave of Rome. Actually, you probably mean before the Cave of Rome. I'm actually kind of curious what's in here. I'm just going to rewind once I check it out. Let's see what's in here. It takes us back to Baron. Okay. I was just curious what that was all about. We may take a trip in there in a bit. And there's a reason for that. May light shine upon the liquid. We need a lot of XP. Actually, Ross doesn't look like she needs that much. Yeah, I'll say it. Why not? So I wish to continue, yes. Farewell and good luck. Go now, Liquid. He healed us, I believe. Yeah, he did. When the light flashed at the beginning there. Okay, we just saved it at that guy. So if I cast Return, I'm going to go back there. We're going to run back to Baron real quick. We need to go to the tool shop. And do it in a very drunken manner. Apparently, I can't walk straight. I want to buy a Wing of the Wyvern. We're going to give it to... I'm going to give it to Liquid. Just in case What's-His-Face dies, Glenn. Because Glenn is the only one with Return. Let's cast Return. This should take us back there. Okay, it did. We're going to make a save. And then we're going to go try to get the Hargon's Castle. It is very far away. I'm kind of worried a little bit that I'm not leveled up enough, but I honestly don't remember what level I need to be for this part of the game. All right, let's go. Oh, that didn't take long. Okay. Blizzards. Now that I'm seeing them, it's all coming back to me now. Blizzards cast defeat. We need to kill him, like, immediately. In fact, I'm going to actually have both Liquid and Glenn attack it because I don't know if Liquid can one-shot it or not. You can, uh... Staff of Thunder to Giant, I guess. Blizzards are very, very... Oh my... Man, that hurt. Blizzards are very, very bad. Okay, I saw I saw a word that started with DEF and thought he was casting defeat for a second. Alright, it's dead. Now your turn. At least there's only two enemies. Giants, they just hit hard. They have a lot of hit points. I believe they are upgraded versions of Cyclopses. I think it's I think it goes Cyclops and Giant. Wit and Courage have served thee well for Roz has been promoted. Power increases by 3, reaction by 4, hit points by 12. She needed that. Magic points by 3, and she got a spell. What spell did you get? Step Guard. Well, now's a fine time to get that. If it gets really bad before I get to Hargon's Castle, I start running into a lot of fights or something like that, I'm just gonna return. I could probably use a couple levels. Gold Batman's. I could be wrong, but these things might cast Sacrifice. I might be wrong on that. We're probably going to find out because there's three of them here. 
Oh, they do put people to sleep with their breath. That's not great. Shoot. Oh, this is bad. Alright, Liquid, you think you could kill something before they put you back to sleep, maybe? They use Firebane. Okay, nobody got put to sleep. Liquid, you're gonna have to do more than that. Oh, Glenn, of course you would go after a different one. Okay, Glenn, I don't want you getting too hurt here. Use your shield. You're going to use the staff. Alright, that should be one dead. Well, maybe they don't cast Sacrifice, but they are sure doing everything else. Firebane, Sweet Breath, Blow Fire. I'm gonna have him use his now. We'll fight. Let's try to put him down. Yeah, everything in this area is a threat, and everything in this area is going to cause us to go through our magic really quick. We're going to have to heal after almost every fight. A lot of XP here, though. I'm not even that worried about getting inside of Hargon's castle right now. I just want to find it. I believe it's over here. Uh, we're not getting that far. We're getting attacked a lot. Yeah, you see how much damage they've done to Liquid already, and that's just the two of them attacking one time. Well, we haven't died yet, so that's a good sign. The Sword of Destruction. Quit and Courage have served thee well, for Glenn has been promoted. Power increases by 2, reaction speed by 3, hit points by 12. Now, about the Sword of Destruction... It is a cursed sword. I think it might be the strongest sword in the game, but it is cursed. There is a trick to get around the curse so you can use it. I don't remember what it is. I'm actually not going to use it. I didn't when I beat this when I was younger, and I'm not going to use it now. I don't think I need it that badly. There's the castle. Oh, great. Alright, everybody, please don't get hit with the feed. Alright, one's dead. That's good. Hopefully this one doesn't decide to cast defeat. Defense. I'm convinced they gave this thing defense as a spell to use along with defeat, so when you see the first few letters of defense, you think defeat, because that would be a dirty trick. I may actually make it to the castle. I think I am going the right way. Oh, not one of these things. I'm starting to think, by the way, that defense and increase don't stack. In fact, I tried looking it up, and I can't actually find any sources about it. Oh my god, are you for real? <laughs> I'm gonna absolutely regret what I'm about to do. I don't suppose it works on you. Up. We're about to experience a party. Whoa, really? Oh, Glenn, if you had hit that last one, that would have been perfect. Okay, I figured he would cast defeat and it wouldn't actually do anything, but it's not really going to matter because he's not killing this by himself. Uh, we might have a problem. We might face our first party wipe here if Glenn can't get the hell away from this thing. Okay. Well, <laughs> we're gonna have to go back. I 
Man, Glenn. For once, you're... For the first time, we've lost two party members at once. And the sole survivor is Glenn. Who saw that one coming? I hope this shining light actually revives Liquid and Roz. It did. So now you see why blizzards are dangerous. That was the one time it cast defeat and it took out two people. I also like how the border and the text all turned orange before it even showed you who died. It was just like, yep, somebody died. Here we go. I guess this is how I'm going to get some XP. Bulwong. I'm going to work on the bat boons. I don't even know what a bulwong does, but I know I don't want to screw around with the bat boons. Plus, I can use the Staff of Thunder on them. Ooh, okay, look, we got one there. You have a range of attack. Whenever you attack, there's like a range of numbers. Sometimes you'll do a really solid attack, and sometimes you'll do a really weak attack. Can you get the work? Oh, wait, no, 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 no. You heal yourself. See, that was a weak attack. Ooh, Bulwong's hit twice and they hit hard. Okay. I might not get too far here. I'm gonna heal all. Uh, <laughs> well, we're going back. Roz is dead. I told you, this place doesn't screw around. You can, you can see just the huge jump in difficulty. Oh man, our using exploded. You can see the huge jump in difficulty as soon as we got here. The enemies are just insanely strong. Difficulty curve just spiked. At least we're getting free revives, not that it really matters. No. Onward again. That should be liquid. Power increases by 5, reaction by 3, hit points by 10. More hit points is better at this point. Yep, oh, we gotta go back. <laughs> I can't even get within sniffing distance of this castle. Not that I probably want to. Ooh, wait, though. A wizard's ring might come in handy. Wizard's ring is what you can use that will restore your magic, and I think when you use it, there's a chance it'll break. It might not necessarily do it. I think it's just a chance. It's not guaranteed to break every time. Darn it, we have to use our winged wyvern, which means I need to go back and get one. Unless I want to try to run back, and I... Well, I don't. Alright, let's give it another shot. Now bear in mind, when I go here and I fight these bosses that are in this place, after I kill every boss, I'm gonna have to probably leave, come back, heal up at the shrine, and then go back to the castle. So long as I don't power the game down, the bosses won't respawn, so I'm basically getting a heal in between the bosses, which it's not the worst idea in the world to do that. But that also means I'm gonna have to make how many trips back to this place. Huh. I wasn't expecting to see all of you guys here. Why is suddenly giving me easier enemies? This is starting to feel sorry for me. Oh, Jesus. I think it's really funny that the first time I've had to feed Castoon on me in this game, it killed two people right off the bat, and now it's not really killing anybody.
More levels the better. Blend's been promoted. Power increases by one, reaction by eight. Uh, hit points by 13, magic points by 3, got Raz too. Power increases by 2, reaction by 10. That's good, that's defense. Uh, hit points increases by 9, magic by 2. So all of these deaths and failures I'm having here in Roan is not the worst thing in the world because it's making me have to go make different attempts to come up to Harkon's castle, and every time I die, I keep doing it, and I'm gaining levels from it. Made it. Huh. Woof woof. Looks a little familiar, doesn't it? myself. I actually didn't think that was going to work. This is Maidenhall Castle. No, it's not. This is an illusion created by Hargon. I don't think anybody says anything here. They all just copy the dialogue from Maidenhall. We use the charm of Rubis. With one hand, Roz held aloft the charm of Rubis. Roz could hear a voice drawing near. Roz, be not deceived by false visions. Oh, this place actually looks like it blows. I don't know if there's enemies on this floor or not. Welcome to Braggle's Tools. May I help thee? Thou hast come to Maiden Hall. Are you still trying to play Let's Pretend? Greetings, I am the Keeper of the Sin. So the flames seem a little bit confused. Okay, let me out. There you go. If you guys cannot crowd the doors, that would make me very, very happy. Say anything. I could tell you everywhere here leads to a dead end, except if we go that way towards that gold door. The fool's false paradise suited thee better. Thou shalt regret meddling in Harkon's affairs. These are not the bosses I was mentioning earlier. These are just a couple of regular gold baboons that we're hopefully going to kill without any problems. Alright, so we need to use step guard because there's a hidden path here. I believe it's right here. step guard again. And again. We need to use the Eye of Malroth. Oh, I'm sorry, Glenn. Here, heal yourself. It's probably costs less than step guard does. I'm actually going to throw a couple heals out here. Okay, so now we have to use the Eye of Malroth. I don't know if it actually tells you this anywhere. Where is the Eye of Malroth? Glenn held high the Eye of Malroth. Alright, this is Hargon's castle. It's set up like a tower. It's also a very 
straightforward dungeon. I don't even know if I really need to bother with a map here. Problem is, on different floors we're going to find some problems. I'm not even going to worry about the babbles until a giant's dead. run without running in any fights here. I'm getting really lucky with the range where there's no fights on this floor. I believe we have to fight a boss here. This is one of the bosses we have to fight, and he did not see us. Sweet. Increase defense. Now, if Liquid were to get a crit here, that would be great. He's got a lot of hit points from what I remember. Hmm. I actually think what I'm going to do... I don't know how well parry works... I'm gonna try to just have them parry because I don't think surround's gonna work on this thing. Sleep definitely isn't. And chances are if I try to cast magic on it, it's not gonna work. I don't know how hard this thing hurts and I wanna find out. Okay, that was doable. Lynn's got better defense than Roz, so I'll let him do the healing. This fight's gonna be all liquid. Uh oh. Oh no, 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 no. Okay, well that didn't work. I think we're dead because I have a feeling Glenn's not gonna be able to hurt this thing. One hit point of damage. They made Glenn like too weak in this game. I think we're in trouble. I think we're about to have our first full party wipe. I don't know how to hurt this thing now. Ross is not going to be able to hurt it. I'm telling you. Explode, it's not going to attack it. How are you missing it as a giant twice in a row, even? Glenn, you're dead. There's nothing you're going to be able to do here. Darn it. I was... It was going so well. And he attacked Liquid, so I couldn't see if, like, the parrying idea worked or not. Yeah. Oh, there you go. First time we've lost a party, the whole party at once. And sadly, it might happen again. Alright, we're gonna load the save slot again, because I'm not walking all the way back here again. Let's try again. Alright. Didn't get lucky with a surprise on him this time. is going to protect them that much. Ooh, okay, I got to heal all off. Yes! Okay, he did not hurt him much while he was parry while he was parrying. 22 and 18 is not that much. I might have this. I think it's going to die. Liquid took a lot of hit points off that crit. I needed that. Got it. 
that crit, I think, was key factor there. Though the parrying was helping. Wit and Courage have served thee well, for Liquid has been promoted to the next level. Power increases by 4, reaction by 4, hit points by 7. I might not leave yet. I think I'm just gonna make a save state. Because I really didn't use that much in a way of resources there. And that'll save me having to make a whole nother trek back here. Where do I go here? I'm gonna look at a map. I see where we gotta go. There might not even be encounters in this place, because that's our second boss. I think I'm going to try the same thing I tried last time. I'm hoping you don't cast Sacrifice, that would be bad. Defense didn't work. Okay, he uses Fire Bane, that's nothing I haven't seen before. wonder if Glyn can hurt him. Let's try to fence again. There we go. Nope, Glenn cannot... I don't know why Glenn can't hurt any of the bosses. Alright. You guys just heal for now, then. You can be dummy targets. Surround's probably not going to do anything because he's just using magic. Hmm. I know this isn't going to work. Yeah, see, I keep trying sleep. I have dragon veins. Chances it's going to work are very low. Got it. That wasn't bad at all. I still think I'm getting lucky on these. Like, I'm actually able to go ahead and fight the bosses one after another. Sarlox. Yeah, an upgraded Bull Wong is our last of the three mini bosses here. I have no idea how bad he is. I don't even remember this guy. Let me cast Explode. That's great. Liquid. You're gonna have to fight and everybody else is gonna have to try to stay alive. I'm probably gonna have to leave after this fight. If I survive it. I'm um, gonna let you heal more liquid. I'm going to try to cast defense again. I don't think it's going to do anything, but I don't know what else to do with her. Probably should cast a heal all on liquid. Okay, you heal yourself with the shield since you're self-sustaining. You heal more liquid. Good shot in liquid. Got it. That's a lot of XP. What'd you drop? A little bit of gold. We're gonna trade the wizard's ring to Roz. Just for the hell of it. I think I'm gonna try to go ahead and do this. I don't have much magic. But I'm only fighting one more boss, so it might be alright. I gave the wizard ring to Roz, so we'll see. Alright, this is it. Hi, you, uh, must be Hargon. Who comes hither to disturb the great Hargon? Does Sal know who I am? No. Then I shall teach the proper respect. Let's see you do that, Mr. Smiley Back Clothes person. Alright, we're gonna go and increase. Defense. 
Argon might kill me, I'm not sure. That didn't work, did it? Oh, <laughs> well, that's not good, is it? Liquid, you need to wake up, because I guarantee you Glenn can't hurt him. Yep. Liquid, wake up. Everybody needs to hurry up and wake up. We can't be sleeping for this fight. And Glenn, you can't even hit the guy. Wow, you really are into the sleep spell, aren't you? Alright, come on, Liquid. It's not really doing anything that offensive right now. Heal all. Great. I hope I don't have to use, like, the Eye of Malroth here. Maybe I should try to use it. I don't remember if I have to use that in this fight. About time you did something to hurt me. Not that I really want you to. Let's see what happens. Oh, you, yeah, yeah, you do have it. I don't think that's going to do anything. Oh god, okay. We gotta stop screwing with him now. Yeah, nothing happened, okay. For some reason I thought maybe if I used the Eye of Malroth he might switch to another form or something, because this is not the last fight. Spoilers. Glenn, use your shield and you better use it before he does something or you're probably going to die. Alright, you know what? Yeah, waste your turn. Give us a chance to get everybody else healed here. This is going to be kind of difficult because he keeps healing himself. I might need a good crit again. Problem is, I just I can't keep heal mooring forever here. Nice. Why is, is there a way around this? <laughs> Stop spell surely isn't going to work. Glenn, you are completely useless in this fight outside of healing. It pretty much describes every boss fight I've had you in. He runs out of heal walls or something at some point. Uh... Okay, I might have to look this up because <laughs> I don't know if he's going to stop doing that or what. This is getting kind of ridiculous. I can't really kill him if I can't. If he's gonna heal every round. I feel like I can't do this unless I get a crit on him. Yeah, magic's probably not gonna work on him. No, my luck. I'll try to fence. I don't know if I got the fence off on him before, but it's not working anyway. I 
30 hit points just isn't gonna get it done. Okay, hold up. Time out. Okay, near as I can tell, there is in fact no trick here. I just need to get lucky and hopefully he doesn't heal every single time I'm about to kill him. Also, the one thing I read said that the Staff of Thunder was very effective and it almost always works on Hargon. So, that guy's a little bit incorrect. I don't see myself doing this because I'm going to be completely drained of resources by the time I get this thing dead. Might have to just throw myself at this a few times because I don't know if I'm getting really unlucky with the range or what it is. I can't do it much longer. In fact, I just lost liquid, which means I'm dead. There's nothing I can do. In fact, I think I'm just gonna reload and count this as a death for Glenn and Roz, other than sit here forever. Maybe I'll try to do something. I don't suppose we can find out a Firebane and Explode it work, I guess. Explode it does work. Not that I can really use it in this fight, I don't have enough time to do it. Yeah, he heals all way too much. I think I'm going to forfeit this fight because there's nothing else I can do. I'll just consider this a death for Glenn and Roz because I'm just going to be sitting here toying with him forever. I'm going to reload and do this again. They were going to die eventually, there was nothing I could do about it. Uh, let's try yes, see what he says this time. I'm going to actually save state here. Yes. Such audacity is unforgivable. Because I know who you are, wouldn't that like, be considered a compliment for you? Alright, um... Increase is just, like, defense for physical attacks, right? That doesn't do anything for magic. Increase, I think, just works for physical defense. I'm not going to do increase. Maybe I'll throw off a firebane and see if it actually hurts him. I will, however, use defense. I don't know if it's going to work or not, though. It ain't looking good. Maybe I'll just work on attacking him. We'll go all out. Firebane does work. Okay. Fine. We'll do it this way. Oh, now you're gonna physically attack. Because I didn't cast Increase. That jerk. That was defeated the Hargon. So that was proven a mighty warrior, mightier, mightier even than Hargon the Great. But there is one even greater than I, the sorcerer of the Shadow Time. The Shadow Time. A being of pure malice that none shall overcome. I send thee now to meet Malroth. Well, this shouldn't be too hard, he's missing an eye. Where is he? He's giving me a chance to heal. That's nice of it. Oh man, I, I'm gonna have to burn through some magic here. That sucks. I want to get everybody healed up. All the way, if possible. So Glenn's not gonna have a lot of magic. Okay. This must be him. One Malroth appeared. Well, I'm glad it's only one. Oh, 
Well, I don't remember this fight at all. I don't know what he does. So let's dive in and hope for the best. <laughs> Are you just showing off that you can cast heal all? You're not even hurt yet. Okay, I got his defense down. Like, would this be another great time to get a crit off? Or Firebane will hurt him. Oh my, his breath hurts a lot. Okay. Use your shield. And you're gonna have to heal. flames every round. Don't you have something stupid you can do, like cast sleep or something? Shield of strength. Heal more herself. Hopefully he keeps getting last attack. Oh man, his fire hurts bad. to heal all on liquid. Oh, you jerk. You're gonna be like, hark on with this, aren't you? Man, Glink cannot take that fire. Of course it didn't. Firebane didn't work either. Jeez, is this all he does? This and heal. Shield of strength, uh, heal more liquid. Liquid's still alive, but we're gonna have a problem next round. Everybody's hurt really bad. You're gonna have to use your shield. You're gonna have to heal yourself. I might need to try to get another defense off on him, because it feels like Liquid's not doing as much damage now. I don't know how I'm gonna do it, though. I can't get a chance in here with all the healing I have to do. Try it. Oh, that's not great. What happened with the wizard ring? That went so quick I couldn't even see it. I think she got a little bit of magic back. So we'll try to do this without. Oh my god, I did it. I thought as soon as Glenn was dead, we were finished. I can't believe we did it. Thou hast defeated the Malroth. Thou hast delivered the world from Malroth's evil. Great is victory and greater the rewards. I, Rubus, have watched the struggles and I am proud of thee. You better be because that sucked. Go now. Alright, I'm saving it after that because, wow. And she even revived Glenn. So he can bask in our victory. Okay, wow, his castle's gone. So like Dragon Warrior 1, there are no more enemies. Everything's dead. So I can walk over here and see what's over here. Was this an alternate path to get the Hargon? Looks like it was, so there were two ways to get to him. It is so nice walking around Roan and not getting attacked. I can't believe I did that. I did that without having to go back, too. I never left the castle. Unless, well, I guess you could say that I 
reload it when I got a party wipe against uh, Argon, but... Oh, it is like a dream to think that someone had the power to destroy Argon. The people will be free again, for the evil magic has dissipated like smoke in the wind. Well, let's go back to Baron. Do barriers still hurt us? No. Wait, is there a demon outside? Thanks to thee, peace has returned. Why is there a demon outside? I don't remember this. You were here the whole time and I never saw you? Brr. You got a problem? Go on, say something. Yeah, you better walk away. With your stupid little tail. I like how barriers have just stopped working completely. People will be free again for the evil magic is dissipated. Okay, you said that. Anybody else have anything new to say? Thou art great warriors. talk to a few people. There's a couple places I want to stop by. Thanks to the peace has returned. Before we finish this off, I have a feeling we've probably seen all the regular dialogue that average people say. Thanks to the peace has returned. Yeah, it looks like that's the extent of what people are going to say, but there are at least two places I can think of I want to check out. Argon doesn't exist anymore, does he? No, he doesn't. I got a critical on him, and it was a fine-ass crit. Thanks to thee, peace has returned. Yeah, nobody's really saying anything different. That was done exceedingly well. I wonder if it's based on what their sprites look like. They seem to say something. They seem to say something according to what their sprites look like. What kind of sprite they have. That was done exceedingly well. Thank you, dangerous prisoner. Okay, there's two places I want to check out before we go. I'm assuming we go back to Modern Hall to wrap this up. Okay, actually three places I want to go. We're going to go to Charlock because I want to go talk to the Dragon Lord's descendant after we did this. We're going to go to Moonbrook because I want to talk to the uh, princess's father, his spirit. Thou art strong and noble, Liquid. Well done. Do you have anything to say, Saber Lion? Bow, wow, wow. Are you pretending to not be a Saber Lion anymore? Let's stop by Canuck real quick and see if the prince's dad has anything to say. Hey, are you going to yell at me about tearing about now that I ended all the bad stuff that was going on? Brother, thou hast done well. I shall never doubt thee again. Your brother died more times than I can count. What about me? Jerk. Hello, your son is still alive for a moment. He seems to die a lot. Once again, the line of Erdwick has proven true. Glenn, my heir, thou hast gained a great victory, and I am proud of thee. To, th to thy new duties thou must go now, Liquid. Off to my new duties I go. What, I'm supposed to do more stuff? I'm a prince, I just want to be lazy. Alright, princess, let's go see your dad and tell him that we've avenged his death. See a light, that is the pure light of Rubis rising from the sea. We thank thee for all that thou hast done. You would think you guys would, like, disappear and be able to rest or something. Same thing. See a light that is pure light of Rubus. Oh, well, I guess your dad doesn't have anything he'd like to say about you, princess. Dad's kind of a jerk. What about that guy that hangs out in the basement? Does he have anything to say? 
Thou art great warriors. I can't believe you've lived in this basement all this time. One more stop for Maidenhall. I'm gonna go check out Charlock. Actually, I should go check out Tanagel too, but that's right there. I can do that. Hi, I saved the world while you were sitting in here. Just wanted you to know. I apologize for deceiving thee. I am the king of this castle. Ha ha. You're dressed as a king. You're not very good with disguises then, are you? Like, did you not think to maybe change your clothes or something? Alright, let's hit Charlock. Doesn't look like there's anything else going on here. Just want to make a note though, I did that without using any cursed items. I did that also without using the water flying cloth duplication trick. I did not use cheats in this outside of the fact that I used save states for convenience sake. Kinda happy about that. Hey, guess what I did? Thou hast done well, Liquid. Let bygones be bygones, and we shall be friends. So you're not gonna breathe fire on me, Escarade. Appreciate it. I just gotta get out of here and get the mine hall. Made it. Hey, where'd everybody go? Ah, uh, am I gonna have a little victory parade? It looks like it. I don't see anybody. Now thou art king of Maidenhall, must take thy throne. Wow, this is moving pretty quickly. Oh, okay, you guys have left me. Thou shalt go. Shalt I? What? I seek not the crown. <laughs> you don't really have much of a kingdom to have a crown for anymore, do you? Liquid, thou art of the line of Erdwick and have proven thy heritage by thy deeds. Now is the time for thee to take the throne. Will it be so? Oh, so in addition to sending your son out on a dangerous journey to kill this, uh, nutcase Hargon, you have decided that you're done being king. It's too much work. You're gonna make me the king now. Fine. Hail all to the new monarch of mine and all. Now Glenn, Prince of Canuck, come forth. Ra's Princess of Moonbrook, come forth. This charge I lay on the three heroes that forevermore they guard against evil. Three cheers for new monarch of mine and all. Hip hop array. And hip hop array. Then peace returned. Well, it's good to know that Hargon was the only thing stopping there from being peace in the land. Alright, that was it. That was Dragon Quest 2, Dragon Warrior 2, whatever you want to call it. Uh, the hardest of the Dragon Warriors, in my opinion, at least out of the ones I've played. Definitely the hardest one on the NES. Usually you'll hear me say whenever I beat a game, that wasn't as hard as I thought it was going to be. This was as hard as I thought it was going to be. That was a giant pain, especially from Roan on, but I am pretty impressed with myself that I managed to basically run through Hargon's castle and not have to leave. I beat all three of those bosses, I beat Hargon and I beat Malroth without having to leave. Now there's a side note to that, and that's the fact that Hargon did manage to kill me with a full party wipe, but still. It wasn't bad though. I have a lot of good memories of this game just from you know, playing it growing up. I don't know if I'll ever play this again, at least this version of the game. This is probably me wiping my hands of it for the rest of my life. If I play this again, I'll probably play, I think the, I don't know if it's the GBA or Game Boy Color or something did a version of this game. I'll play that remake of it because I think they probably rebalanced the end of the game a bit. We'll say the doubled mod worked perfectly in this game. I don't think I ever had the farm during that whole playthrough, but the game still felt challenging. So go Silax for that. That hack worked really, really well. And there's all the Erdwick stuff, I guess, just lying around in the dirt. The end.